And welcome to neutral side action, and we're just about ready for kickoff. And now let's head down to the coin toss, and it's brought to you by Coke Zero. Real Coca-Cola taste and zero calories. Enjoy everything. We're ready to get this one underway as the teams are lined up for the opening kick. Excellent kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The quarterback leads the team out on the field for the first drive. Tackle around the 27-yard line. From their own 27-yard line, second down. Given there's nowhere to run. Throws it, watch out. Oh, almost had a pick. Well, the defense stood tall there. Well, the defense did what they had to do to get three and out and now get the offense back on the field. They look like they've got the block on, and this offensive line's got to give him some time. He makes it out to midfield. Lawrence is a guy we've seen, Kirk, when he plays on the road. He's almost like uh, he wants to quiet the crowd and say, you know what, bring it, and I'll bring it right back to you. Yeah, I think one of the things you have to do as a quarterback when you go on the road and you get in this kind of tough environment is, is get off to a fast start. And he told us this week one of the big things that he's trying to emphasize to his team is that it's not just to go out and win on the road. Let's take the crowd out of the game early by making some big plays, and then let's just go out and play our game. Nice play there to pick up the first down. He did a great job of getting up in the air, ignoring the defenders, and coming down with the ball. They'll bring him down at the six. Down at the three. Touchdown, Tigers. Nice run and a score by the halfback. And a nice call by the coach there. Just give it to your main man anytime you're near the goal line. Seems like ultimately they weren't quite sure what was coming at them, and they gave up the score. And he tacks on the extra point. So a four-play, 48-yard drive, and it's good for seven points. So our score, 7-0. Potter, ready to kick. Sends it sailing downfield. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The Tigers are right where they want to be early in this one, partner. Well, this is what their coach talked about, getting off to a great start. The defense did their job, and it's nice to see the offense move the ball down the field and also get some points on the board. And while they are behind, they know they can knock things up in a heartbeat. It's way too early to change your game plan. Here's an opening, and he's taken down at the 33-yard line. It's second down, and they're about two yards away from the sticks. Nice run there as they work the outside. Pretty good gain on the play by the halfback. Good play here. Getting a new set of downs and keeping the run an integral part of this offense. Decent run up the gut. Second down and six. Ball on their own 42. He 
He's at the 40. Inside the 30. He goes down at the 22. Now that is exactly how you draw up the option. When this offense is executing the option effectively, they are a tough team to stop from moving the ball. Looking to capitalize on the big run. Now it's first and 10. Big opening. Heading for the corner. Touchdown, Tigers. Well, the quarterback just showed us he can beat you with his feet as well as his arm. And what a dangerous weapon this guy is. They'll line up for the extra point in an attempt to tie the game. He makes the PAT. York has his kick team lined up, and he is set to kick this one off. He really got a hold of that kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The quarterback is on his way back onto the field, and he led a great drive last time out. And here's a quick throw. Oh, boy, almost intercepted. Hey, I know he dropped it, but the safety put himself in a position to make a play. That's impressive. So it's second and 10. Ball on the 25-yard line. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. Good solid defense there to force him into a fourth down situation. to get a few yards on the run back. Yeah, but I'll tell you, Brad, with so much traffic in the middle there, it really makes it tough to break free. Every drive's important in a tie game. I look for both sides to come out with some urgency. They'll work the left side. He's taken down right around the 42-yard line. The halfback picks up a yard. It's second and nine. Ball in the 42. A quarterback in the gun with five receivers. Gets it out to his receiver in a hurry. And down he goes at the 49-yard line. So he picked up a few on that run. Yeah, he did a nice job of using his blockers on that run. Really a nice read. First and 10. Ball on the 47-yard line. Let's it go. Stays in bounds to make a nice catch. He's at the 20. He's tackled at the 11-yard line. From the 11-yard line, first down. He might not be able to get the pass off. They'll make the sack. It was the safety who came from the secondary who made the sack. Man, this is an aggressive defense. Another blitz, and again, it works out. They send guys from everywhere to get to this quarterback. Check mine, check mine. Come on, baby, come on, baby. Woo! Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. It's 
Swings it out left to the halfback. Tackle made at the 11. And Kirk, that was a nice grab there. You know, it may be simple, but whenever you can gain solid yardage, you're doing something right. This is the eighth play of this drive. Quick throw, out of bounds at the one. This should be an easy field goal. The Tigers lose one of their key players with that injury earlier. Still in the locker room. We don't know the severity, but unlikely that he'll play any more football this afternoon. And it splits the uprights. Even though they gave up a field goal here, that defense is feeling pretty good about themselves right now. It could have just as easily been a touchdown. LSU to kick. And he got all of this one. Great kick. He'll return it from the one. Tackle at the 28-yard line. You never like to have to play from behind, but a deficit this manageable shouldn't be in the front of their minds. They just need to go out there and play. He goes downtown. Good job here by the defense. If you let this quarterback set and throw, he'll kill you all game. But they got excellent pressure on that play. Second down, 10 yards to go. Ball on their own 28. run up the middle he's got it out to his tight end and he's tackled at the 40 excellent job by this young quarterback of making the defense pay for bringing both outside linebackers that's composure right there. Caught with room to work. And they make the stop at the 49. And that is a great call and a big game, especially on an early down. He's tackled in the open field. field and he shoved out of bounds at the 35 yard line and this play is number eight on the drive feeds it to the back nice run and he's brought down Left side after a nice pickup. Nice Throws complete. He's got room to work. Throws in the middle. Tackle right around the 16-yard line. Fires out to his wideout. And that sets them up for the first and goal. They'll get him for a loss. Well, that's just a good call from the defensive side of the football. They know what this team likes to run, and they got the better of them that time. They're at the two. Second down. Touchdown, Clemson! This 
this kid is a really reliable weapon. You definitely want the football in his hands near the end zone, and he showed you why right there. And he converts the extra point. Potter has the ball set, and he looks ready to kick this one deep. Nice kick, plenty of distance. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Right, this has been a great game to watch. A lot of competitive spirit out there. The offenses seem to be going up and down the field. Back and forth we go. I think the winner will be which defense can make that pivotal stop to secure a victory. And while they are behind, they know they can knot things up in a heartbeat. It's way too early to change your game plan. And they get him in the backfield for a loss. So it's second and 12. Ball on their own 23. He's scrambling. They bring him down. Well, we talked all week with these coaches, and even when we met with them yesterday out at practice, they told us there were some big concerns about facing these defensive ends. They thought that they might be able to hold up against him, maybe get the ball out of the pocket a little bit quicker, maybe use running backs and tight ends to help with double teams on the outside. But right now, whatever they thought they might be able to do, they better get back to that drawing board because these defensive ends are just too quick. Setting up blockers, the running backs got it on the screen. Knocked out of bounds at about the 21. Broke away from one. The offense didn't appear to be in sync on that series. Rodgers will be the return man. He really got a hold of that one. Rodgers fields it at the 34. Tackle made at the 48-yard line. the offense really came up with a nice drive there last time out and most of those yards came through the air this defense needs to improve from front to back the line needs to put more pressure on the quarterback and the defensive backs need to stick it to these receivers with tighter coverage i like how the defense got all up into that option to disrupt it the offense looks a bit unsettled after losing that battle from their own 44 yard line it's second down clemson is up by four He's at the 40. They'll bring him down around the 32-yard line. Here we go. Quick throw out to the receiver, incomplete. There's one the quarterback would like to rewind because he has a wide open receiver and he just misfires. From the 32-yard line, second down. They hand it off again. And he's tackled after positive yardage. Not over here! Not over here! Not over here! Play action under pressure. Brought down at the 26-yard line. I think the play call was the right one by the offense. I just think the defense made a better play. They seem to want it more here on this big third down. Offense comes up a little bit short to set up a fourth down, but give all the credit to the personnel on the defensive side of the ball. It's up, and it's good! And he's got to be happy about that kick. Oh, no question. This kid is just a solid kicker. 17-10, Clemson. He just drills this one. Potter gets set to kick this one away. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. You never like to have to play from behind, but a deficit this manageable shouldn't be in the front of their minds. They just need to go out there and play. And they get nice yardage on that run. It's second and five here. Ball on their own 30.
and he's taken down the 39-yard line. Gains his way to midfield. From the 50, first down. A two-yard run by the halfback. He's brought down there by the senior at linebacker. That won't be the last time today we'll be talking about this young man. out to about the 45-yard line. From the 45-yard line, third down. Here's a quick throw. It's picked off, and it's the sophomore. Not only did he demonstrate his leaping ability, but he also has the hands to be able to pull the ball in. Great job. So at the end of one quarter, the Tigers lead 17-10. And we're back for more action here in quarter number two. Clemson is up by a touchdown. Open man, quick strike, and he can't pull it in. There's a player down. I'm not sure what happened. It's second and ten. Ball on the 24-yard line. Taken down at about the 35. Here we go, deep, all day, defense, all day, all day. Hey, check back 45. Check back 45. He's on the run. He makes his way to about the 42. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. Let's go, D. Let's go, D. Defense wins championships, baby. 45 to Mike. Check it out. Check it out. He's at the 20. And they bring him down at the nine yard line. Tackled after a decent run up the gut. And off, and he's met in the backfield. We're at play number nine of this current drive. The Tigers lost one of their key guys earlier to that injury, and unfortunately, I don't think he's going to play any more football today. Scrambling around. Decides to tuck it in, and he's got space. Things can get pretty fierce in this territory, but they look totally in control there. the PAT. An eight-play, 76-yard drive, and they come away with a touchdown. You know, this offensive line has done a really good job, but really, I think it's more about the big play ability from the running backs and why we've seen so many big plays from this offense. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. 
The quarterback comes back on the field, and I'm sure he's hoping to make up for that interception on the last drive. The game is in danger of getting out of hand early. It's very, very important that they not only hang on to the football this drive, but they also need to get a score on the board as well. He's tackled with a 38-yard line. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 38-yard line. Burrow with the play fake. And down he goes. Right around the 42-yard line. That one's more than good enough for the first down. Well, Brad, that is a great play by the quarterback to find his target past the marker to keep this drive moving. From the 42-yard line. First down. Looks left, finding his tailback. Tackle made at the 40-yard line. forward to about the 40. I think anytime you lose yardage, it's frustrating as a ball carrier. It's very frustrating as a play caller. Makes you a little bit more hesitant maybe to go back to a certain play. The biggest thing you want to do as an offensive coordinator is get the offense over to the sideline after the series. Make sure everybody's on the same page and then show the confidence that you still have in them despite this play that you're going to go right back to the running back and trust that offensive line. Pulls it in and stopped in his tracks with that tackle. They'll call on the field goal unit. He gets it up, and he missed it left. No good. You think about the challenges these two teams are facing. On one side, you've got to find a way to keep building on your lead. And on the other side, you've got to find a way to get back in it. And he's tackled around the 45-yard line. there to stop him. Makes the catch and he's got nowhere to go. Well, I think the linebacker here does such a good job of disguising his blitz. As a linebacker in college football, one of your biggest responsibilities is being able to get to the quarterback. And that time, he timed it up perfectly, was able to get through the offensive line and put the pressure on the quarterback. He'll try to knock this punt down inside the 20. Sometimes it's not the huge distance, but precision that you need from your punter. Nicely done. The quarterback leads the offense back out onto the field as we get set to resume play. Makes it to the 22-yard line. The back gets three on the carry. Second and seven. Ball on the 22-yard line. Pass and hit hard as he came down with it. Right, 
caught it, but they're going to lose yards. He was tackled immediately. They couldn't get anything to work, and it will be fourth down. Rodgers is back deep to return. Brought down at the 48. Clemson's offense is just clicking on all cylinders, Herbie, right now. It's everything they planned for, and it's all working. Everything is coming together for this offense. They seem to be getting better with each series. And, you know, this game started where this team was, you know, they wondered if they were going to be able to move the ball against this defense. And I think right now, I think they seem to, as I said earlier, they seem to be growing with their confidence with each possession. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. They make the stop at about the 29-yard line. Fires that quickly, incomplete. So it's second and ten. Ball in the 29. He has some room. Tackle at the 16. He gets out to about the eight. Ball is loose. They fall on it, and he's stopped behind the line. Third and 11. Ball on the 17. They'll spread the field with five wide. Fires out to his receiver. They'll bring him down at the eight-yard line. Kicks away, and it splits the uprights. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. Nice kick, plenty of distance. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. It's still only the second quarter. We've got a lot of football left, but I've got to say, this one is teetering on the brink of a blowout. Up the middle for a nice game. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. They'll bring him down for a loss on the play. Just throws this one away. They're stacking the line. It looks like they're coming after this punt. He's taken down at the 42-yard line. Things are on the verge of getting out of hand before we even hit the half. 
These next few drives are going to go a long way in determining what kind of game this will end up being. Quick shot to the tight end, and he can't pull it in. Second down and 10 to go. Ball in the 42. That's a great tackle at the 34-yard line. Third down, and they need to get it inside the 48. Three down, three down. Hey, check Mike, check Mike, Mike six, Mike six. Now it's going to be fourth down. Nice defense. That was picture perfect three and out. Good series for these guys. He gets out to about the 38-yard line. It's still only the second quarter. We've got a lot of football left, but I've got to say, this one is teetering on the brink of a blowout. He gets out to about the 38-yard line. Second down and nine to go. Ball on the 38. Five guys will be out in the pattern as they're in the shotgun. Brought down at the 48-yard line. Makes it out to about the 40. It's second down, and they're about two yards away from the sticks. He makes it to the 38-yard line. Wrestle him down in the backfield. Fourth down. They call on the kicker for a long field goal. The kick is up. It's got the distance. And he splits the uprights. LSU. Get set to kick this one away. He's to the 20, looking for the corner. They'll bring him down at the 30-yard line. So we're just about ready to return to action. after positive yardage. Play fake, looking to run. He chucks it downfield. Complete. He's pushed out of bounds at the 20. Almost has the INT. You never know what will happen when the ball ricochets like that. Good effort by the defender. From the 20 yard line, it's second down. And he's taken down at the 12. Nice 
nice run there. He decided to keep it himself this time on the option, and he managed to get upfield and pick up the first down. Clemson with a first and goal here, and this defense needs a stop or this game could get out of reach. Touchdown, Clemson! That gives him another touchdown to go along with the one he scored earlier. This young man is no stranger to the end zone. That's two rushing scores for him on the day, and you have to love the way he's been running the ball all game. He splits the uprights with the extra point. So that's a six-play, 70-yard drive, and they add seven points to the scoreboard. Potter gets set to kick this one away. He's to the 20. He got hit hard. Things are on the verge of getting out of hand before we even hit the half. These next few drives are going to go a long way in determining what kind of game this will end up being. Would have been a big play by the defense. He can't hold it. From their own 26-yard line, it's second down. He lets it fly. That close to being intercepted. Throws a bullet. Great catch there before they can knock him out of bounds. From the 46-yard line, it's first down. Sends it out quick, intercepted. He's at the 30, he's at the 20. To the 10. Touchdown, Tigers. So a great play by the defender to give his team six points. And it was a very good play, and that will certainly help build his team's momentum. And he tacks on the extra point. They line up to kick this one away. Sends it sailing downfield. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. So the offense will come back out onto the field, hoping for a little better result than that last pick six. This quarterback needs to be a little bit more careful because this defense is excellent on capitalizing off of mistakes. He fights forward to about the 26. The Tigers will use their first time out of the half. Second down and nine to go. Ball on the 26. He's to the 40. Finds his receiver, and that's a first down. What a throw for a big game. That is a great example of the quarterback seeing the whole field and finding the guy who had the best chance of making a catch. complete he's got space to work he's taken down at the 46 yard line LSU's gonna have to use their second time out of the half from their own 46 yard line second down he lets it fly it's caught the 10 and they finally knock him out at the one and it's almost picked off. Second down, goal to go. Ball on the one. Touchdown, LSU! 
Great job of finding the space to run and just bursting in for six. And he adds the extra point. So a six play, 74 yard drive. And it's good for seven points. LSU is ready to kick it away. And he got all of this one. Great kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The Tigers are just cruising through this first half, Herbie. Really a comfortable lead here. Yep, but still a lot of football left to be played. they got to remember that it's a four-quarter game, and even though that first half went pretty well, things can change in a hurry. It's still only the second quarter. We've got a lot of football left, but I've got to say, this one is teetering on the brink of a blowout. Looks to the back and can't connect. From their own 25-yard line, second down. Zips it to the back. And down he goes at the 32. Pulls in the pass and steps out. First and 10. Ball on the 37. He's going to try and scramble, and he's tackled at the 37. Clemson will take a timeout. That's their second of the half. Completes it, but he can't shake the defense. Scrambling around, and they got him. Clemson's called their final timeout. It's fourth down, and they're going to try to go for it. I guess he'll throw this one as far as he can and hope for a miracle. Incomplete. And that'll do it for the first half. Still plenty of football to be played. The Tigers with a three-touchdown advantage. Glad to have you with us in the studio for the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Reese Davis and David Pollock here completely locked in on that first half. Exciting first half there. It seemed like every time you turned around, there was another big play. Both of these offenses coming up with yards and chunks, and it's really paid off for them in the first half. Yeah, and uh, it's one thing for offenses to execute and, and get little plays here and there and continue drives, but it's really nice when you hit home runs. It's really nice to make it simple and say, all right, we're going to get about 50 right here. We're going to get about 30 right here. You know, the offense came simple. Uh, you know, great job playmakers making plays, breaking tackles, you know, spinning off players, making big, making big gains. You know, listen, it makes offense very simple. There's no secret to it. If you got all explosive offenses that can do this, can get big chunk plays, they're going to score a lot of points every single game. That's going to do it for David and me here in the studio. Time to get you back to the game. Brad and Kirk ready to take you home in the second half. All right, Reese and David, thanks, guys. Second half action just about ready to start here. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. This one's going to be down to the end zone for a touchback. And here we go with the offense ready to get things going again. Okay, just like that. They'll give it off here. And he hits him hard at the 40. I got one, I got one. Hey, check back, check back, back six, back six. Tackle right around the 48 yard line. Half 
back's got it on the quick throw. Steps out of bounds. At about the 39-yard line. They fake the handoff and complete the pass. Good for six yards. And it was a simple throw right back to the halfback who did a good job of getting some positive yards on the play. They'll bring him down at the 37-yard line. And he makes it out to about the 37-yard line. From the 37-yard line, second down. And they make the stop around the 24-yard line. tailback and he's met in the backfield back to the running back and he gets nowhere and they'll look to convert here on another third down goes out of bounds around the 18 yard line it's up and it sails through the uprights looks like they're ready for the kick Nice kick, plenty of distance. He's to the 20. They bring him down, and they bring him down hard on that one. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. Quick strike, and he drops it. Not a great throw by the quarterback, but to be fair, that was pretty good coverage. From their own 26-yard line, it's second down. Fires incomplete. Here's a quick throw. And he's got his receiver. It's the sophomore. Tackle made around the 33-yard line. Now it's first and 10 after the big pass play. Setting up blockers, or running backs got it on the screen. Touchdown, Tigers! That was some kind of catch and run by the halfback. Uh, that was a mismatch that the offense took advantage of. He completely burned the defender for the score. So the offense will stay on the field and attempt the two-point conversion. Get the two. A four-play, 74-yard drive. But the failed two-point conversion keeps it a six-point score. Well, Brad, right now this offense is hot. And they also took advantage of some mistakes there by the defense. He's to the 20. Brought down at the 27-yard line. Well, the defense held him to three on their last possession. 
Pitching a shutout on this drive would be even better. Makes it to the 37. With a quick throw. Got him. Inside the 30. He's tackled at the 16. He's taken down at the 13. Somebody jumped early down there. That penalty drives them back, and they're shooting themselves in the foot here. Well, if they could just keep their concentration, they'll avoid situations like that. From the 18-yard line, it's second down. Makes the grab and steps out right away. And he's hit before he can go anywhere. touchdowns on the ground today for this young man. Boy, this guy's been huge today. It's been a big part of the reason that his team has the lead. And he hits the PAT. A nice seven play, 79-yard drive. And they come away with a touchdown. Brad, I thought that was a textbook drive. I thought they did a really good job of showing balance, mixing the play calling with the run and the pass. Just an overall well-executed touchdown drive. He makes it out to maybe the 23-yard line. Not a whole lot's been working for them so far. They should just come out and play loose and easy because they've got nothing to lose. Grabs it and hammered right there. It's second and seven. Ball on the 25-yard line. Empty backfield, quarterback in the gun. Five wide receivers. Pass complete and taken down immediately. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. From their own 36-yard line, it's first down. Nice run up the middle. Gain of six on the draw play. to fit it in there and it'll be intercepted he's at the 40 he's taken down at about the 33 yard line brad i'm all for continuing to fight and continuing to try to compete but another interception another miscue for this team they're already getting blown out they've got no chance to get back in the game from the 33 yard line first down clemson looking to add to this big lead here 
makes it to the 24. The running back takes the pitch on the option, and that'll be a pickup of about nine. run and he's brought down first and ten ball on the 19 yard line tackle that would be some pickup on the play. I think he made a late read of the defense there. Quarterback needs to be much more decisive with his option reads. We've got a third and six here. Ball on the 15. Over the middle to his tailback. And down he goes around the 13-yard line. They're already up big, and this could make the lead bigger. Kicks up, and he got it. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. He really got a hold of that kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. I hope they show some fight here and try to stay competitive. If you're going to get blown out, you at least want to go down swinging. He gets rid of this one. It's second and ten. Ball on their own 25. Under heavy pressure. Fumble. Scoops up the loose ball. That's a pretty big mistake, and this offense will lose possession of the football. Sloppy job by the ball carrier. First and foremost, you should always be concerned about the ball. The offense ready to go again, and their last drive ended with three points. Clemson. Comes to the line. They got a big advantage in this one. And he's tackled at about the three yard line. We've got second and goal. Ball on the three yard line. Hands off to the right and is brought down in the backfield. for the score, not going to get it. Fourth down, this should be an easy field goal. This is to add to an already impressive lead. Kicks away, and it's through the uprights. Get set to kick this one away. He sends this one deep. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. LSU's getting stomped right now. They're unable to get anything going here in the third quarter. Well, I think what they have to do at this point is they've got to get into a little bit more of a hurry-up mode, a little bit more urgency, score, and hope that the defense can come up with a stop and hope you can get the ball back and put more points in a great tackle at the 31-yard line. 
So it's second down now. They need about four yards to pick up the first. Throws quick to the receiver and it falls incomplete. Makes it out to about the 43. From their own 43 yard line. First down. Now he tries to buy some time. He's at the 40. He's pushed out of bounds. Right around the 36 yard line. First and ten. Ball on the 36-yard line. So an empty backfield with five wide receivers. Finds his man and they take him down immediately. So it's third down now, and they're going to need about four. Makes it to the 17. And this play is number eight on the drive. Hands it to the back. So the halfback loses about two on the run. From the 19-yard line, second down. Tackle around the 17-yard line. This is the 10th play of this drive. Here comes the pressure, and he can't get away from the pressure. I think that one's on the offensive line. They've got to do a better job of holding their blocks, or else this quarterback's going to be pulling turf out of his face mask all game. After the sack, it's now fourth and long. The kick is up, and it's good! That one looked like cake for this kid. Chalk up three points for the offense. So our score, Clemson 57, LSU 29. York is lined up to kick this one off. He'll take it from the two. He's to the 20. He's tackled at the 29-yard line. Clemson's offense has just been dominant here in the third quarter, and it's got to be pretty demoralizing for the defense. Yeah, the defense, I mean, they just have to get some kind of stop here to be able to get some confidence and be able to get their own offense into the position and being able to put some points up. But right now, they just cannot stop this high-powered attack. Clemson up big right now in this one. And they make the stop at the 31. From their own 31-yard line, second down. Fires incomplete. He was looking for the tight end. Yeah. 
He's hit and taken down. Gets it out to his receiver in a hurry. It's a nice job here by the wide receiver of looking the ball in and keeping the chains moving. He was on the same page as his quarterback as they both saw the double outside linebacker blitz coming. Slings it. They'll bring him down around the 48-yard line. Second and six. Ball on the 48-yard line. Tackle made right around the 50. Tackled in the open field. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 45. And it looks like they're going to run away with this one as we head into the fourth quarter. The Tigers are up big. Just about set to start the fourth quarter, mercifully. Clemson in control. Tackled for a loss. The D-line did a good job of nullifying out the blocks up front, and that allowed the linebacker to roam free and make the tackle in the backfield. And this is the eighth play of the drive. Makes it to the 34. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 34. He's on the run. Quarterback's going to run it, and he's got room to work. And he's still on his feet. He's tackled at the 15. Tenth play of the drive. Let's go, Jack. Let's go. We got this. We got this. Hey, check my 45. Check my 45. Run, 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 run. He makes his way out to about the six. It's second down now, and they're just a few feet away from that first down marker. for extra yardage. Too easy, too easy. We're at the 12th play of the drive. They'll give it off here. Brought down just outside the goal line. From the one yard line. Second down. Hey, check Mike, check Mike, Mike six, Clemson Mike six. comes to the line holding that commanding lead. Touchdown, Clemson! The defense hasn't been able to keep this guy from the end zone. He's got four scores. We wondered if the linebackers were going to be able to slow him down today, and I guess that answer is pretty simple. No. And he converts the extra point. It was a 13-play, 70-yard drive, and they come away with seven points. Looks like they're ready for the kick. Excellent kick. He's to the 20. And he's tackled at the 28. I don't expect any once-in-a-lifetime rallies here, but that being said, we could still see some exciting plays. He goes downtown. Oh, he had the pick and he dropped it. So it's second and ten. Ball on their own 28.
Fires out to his wideout. He's taken down at the 34-yard line. So after the big pass play, we've got a first down. He's got it out to his tight end. And he's taken down at about the 27-yard line. Now, I think he's got a good rhythm going right now with his wide receivers. He hit him for a nice game. And he just gets rid of it. They need about three yards to get the first down here on third down. Handoff inside, and he's quickly brought down. Really good play here and run support by the linebacker. The big guys up front took away the running lanes, and he was able to get through for a loss. for a loss and they'll turn it over on downs both teams are playing out the stretch here you want to get experience for guys who normally don't get in the game and try to avoid injuries Clemson up big hands it off and down he goes at the 23 yard line man did he play that perfectly or what as a linebacker you have to be able to read the offense and make a quick diagnosis exactly what he did on that play. It's second down and 11 to go. Ball on the 23. He's in trouble. And he's going to be sacked. They get to the quarterback and end that play before it even got started. This young man didn't even have a chance to make something happen. It's tough to find your receivers when the defense is in your face like that. it out oh boy almost intercepted strong showing by the defense you always like to get the other team's offense off the field as fast as you can they get this one off and it's a beauty tries to get around the corner he gets out to about the 42 yard line I don't expect any once-in-a-lifetime rallies here, but that being said, we could still see some exciting plays. Gets it out quickly, and he's tackled around the 37-yard line. It's second and five here. Ball on the 37-yard line. his receiver and that's a first down tackle at the 26 yard line makes a catch and he's got nowhere to go it's second down seven to go Ball on the 23-yard line. Under heavy pressure. They bring the quarterback down. Well, we talked all week with these coaches, and even when we met with them yesterday out at practice, they told us there were some big concerns about facing these defensive ends. They thought that they might be able to hold up against him, maybe get the ball out of the pocket a little bit quicker, maybe use running backs and tight ends to help with double teams on the outside. But right now, whatever they thought they might be able to do, they better get back to that drawing board because these defensive ends are just too quick. Third down, and they need to get it to the 15. Three, nine. 
Huge gain, and that sets him up nicely with a first and goal. First and goal from the four. They're knocking on the door. They make the stop at about the three-yard line. Well, they're not going to win it, but they're still playing hard out there. There are some guys, when they get near the goal line, they just have a knack for getting the ball into the end zone. That's what we saw right there. And he tacks on the extra point. A seven-play, 41-yard drive, and it results in a touchdown. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. Sends it sailing downfield. He's to the 20. He's taken down at the 24-yard line. Both teams are playing out the stretch here. You want to get experience for guys who normally don't get in the game and try to avoid injuries. Clemson looking to add to this big lead here. Rifles it left. Gets it. He's in space. At the 30. They'll bring him down at the 20-yard line. Now it's first and ten after the big pass play. Three down, three down. Mike A, Mike A. Get down. Little handoff. Nice run to the outside. Dixon picks up about seven yards on the run. A good football team has to consistently be able to capitalize when they're in the red zone. He makes the PAT. It was a quick three-play, 77-yard drive, and that's good for a touchdown. You know, you always prepare your offense to think that we're going to have some success. But these guys got to be coming over the sidelines after touchdown after touchdown saying, man, I, I didn't expect it to be this easy. They're ready to start another drive, hoping to duplicate the results of the last one, which ended in a touchdown. This quarterback right now is in a rhythm, and a lot of that has to do with his preparation. You can see right now with the reads that he's being able to make, getting the football out of his hands, that he's feeling very, very confident in his ability to throw the football against this defense. From their own 25-yard line, it's second down. He throws right. Picked off. It's the cornerback. You don't want to criticize a quarterback for trying to make something happen, but I'm not really sure who he thought he was throwing the ball to there. Here we go, here we go. Here's the mic. Clemson comes to the line in complete control in this game. Fumble. The defense has it. The defense wasn't fooled at all on the option, and it was their discipline that created that turnover. An interception cut this offense last drive short, so I think they're going to be looking for a little more success right here. And I don't think this defense will lay down lightly. They're going to try to continue to rattle this guy. Quick strike, and he drops it. Jefferson does not intend to receive it. That makes it second and ten. 
from their own 43-yard line. Second down. The junior makes the catch. Tackle made at about the 41. Down, 10 to go. Ball on the 41. I'm coming, I'm coming. And a quick throw. He's tackled at about the 37-yard line. out quickly to the tailback. They'll drop him for a loss. Third down now, and they need to get it down to the 31. And that one's incomplete. Accuracy is such a vital part of being a quarterback. You've got to have an ability to lay the ball right into your guys' hands. Brought down at the 30-yard line. From the 30-yard line. First down. down in the open field. Nice job by the running back, and that'll get him seven, maybe eight yards. This is the eighth play of this drive. Three down, three down. Right, cross, right, let's go. Hey, Mike's Green nine, green nine. Blue four. Fires it out, and he's tackled in the open field. From the 14-yard line. First down. And they push him out at the 16-yard line. Here's play number 10 on the drive. He's taken down right around the 12-yard line. Good work here by the defense to keep him from making something more out of that play. From the 12-yard line, it's third down. Less than three minutes in the game. And they got it. They simply have too much speed for this offensive line. They're just too quick off the ball. Well, folks, fourth down again, and it looks like they're going to go for it again. He's under pressure. Quick throw. I'm pretty sure they won't win it, but they haven't quit yet. This guy just continues to impress me. Every time I watch this team play, he seems to come up with big plays. You talk about a clutch play. They couldn't afford any mistakes on fourth down there. And he adds the extra point. And he's taken down at the 40. Well, Kirk, I guess you can say this. If you like offense, it's been entertaining. Well, don't get me wrong. I, I love offensive firepower, but I just wish it was a closer game, more competitive here in the fourth quarter. 
So can the defense match their effort from the last drive with another takeaway? One general rule in any game is to hold on to the ball. If you're in the negative in the turnover department, your chances of winning decrease exponentially. He fights forward to about the 40. From the 40-yard line, second down. the ground with a tailback. Tackled for a loss. Just over a minute in the fourth quarter. Well, a nice stop there late in the fourth quarter, but this game, quite frankly, has been over for a long time, and I'm ready for it to end. So the kicker comes out. He'll try to put three points on the board. This is to add to an already impressive up and he just drilled it from long range Clemson yet set to kick this one away he really got a hold of that kick he's to the 20 oh he got nailed on that one Well, late in the fourth quarter, this game has been over for a long time, and now we just want to get out of here like these two teams do. Makes it out to about the 30. LSU is going to use their first time out of the half here. It's second down, and they're about two yards away from the sticks. He gets rid of this one. throws it away. For Kirk and Aaron, I think I can say we're glad this one's over. 